Hello Year 12, um, I'm, I've just got a couple of notices for you today. Um, firstly, congratulations on your PPE2 results. You should have all received these by now um, through email from either myself or Mr Clark um, or Mr Matthews um, and hopefully you've had time to reflect on these grades. Some of you have done amazingly. I am so, so impressed um, with some of the achievements that some of you have received from these PPE2 grades and it's a real show of your hard work and your determination so congratulations on that I hope you were able to celebrate in your own way at home a little bit. Um, some of you may be feeling a little bit disappointed about your PPE2 grades and there's a really important lesson to learn there. Some of you might look at these and realise that maybe you should have worked a little bit harder, maybe you should have started working harder a little bit sooner and this is a really key point in time at the moment. You've got lots of time at home to be studying um, and also you have time to, to do things that you enjoy. So it's really a really good time to get a balance between those two things and to either catch up on work that maybe you missed out on a little bit whilst we're at school. Maybe you weren't concentrating as much, maybe you didn't revise as much. And this is a really good time to do that. And it's also a really good time to build some really, really good habits. And that kind of leads me on to my next point. Um, what have you been enjoying? What are the things that you have been doing in your spare time that you've really started to enjoy? Um, I know myself, I have been balancing doing work and balancing my hobbies and um, having the time to actually enjoy those hobbies. So I've been reading a lot, as you can probably imagine, being an English teacher. <laughs> Um, I've been cooking a lot more um, and I hope that you guys have been doing the same and I'd really love to hear what you guys have been getting up to um, and having that conversation. Um, and what will you have learned from this time? It's a really strange time um, in all of our lives and something that none of us have experienced before. Um, and it's going on a little bit longer than we expected. We're going to be in our fourth week now of being in lockdown. And that's a long time. That's a month of our lives that we've spent um, predominantly indoors. And I think it's really important that when we come out of this, we're all able to say that we have learned something um, about ourselves, whether that's that you need to work harder on your studies, as I mentioned um, in my first point, whether it's that you've actually learned ways of studying independently that really work for you or whether that you've learned that suddenly you actually like reading or <laughs> helping your parents with the washing up. Um, over these four weeks, I've learned that I enjoy doing exercise, which is never something that I thought I would say. Um, I can come out of this lockdown saying that every other day I've gone for a run, which I think if somebody had said that to me before lockdown, I would have disagreed with them and said I would never do that. Um, so I think it's really important to learn something new about yourself, to do something um, that maybe you wouldn't have thought of doing before. Um, all things that I think are really important. So just to summarise, please be reflective on your PPEs, celebrate those wins and be proud of yourself because there's a lot to be proud of there. But equally, um, don't bury your head in the sand if you didn't do as well as you thought you might do. Take this as an opportunity to catch up, take this as an opportunity to speak to your teachers over email. I know I've now got far, um, far much more time to actually speak to students and have that dialogue. When I'm in school, I'm rushing around. I don't always have the time to have those one-on-one -on -one conversations, but your teachers do have a little bit more time now to do that. So please do ask them um, on what you can be improving on. What have you been enjoying? Please do let me know. And then that final one, um, what have you learnt? What have you learnt from this very strange situation, this very strange world that we find ourselves in now. How will you have grown from this experience? Um, keep working hard, stay safe. I've been making lots of calls this week. I've spoken to a lot of you, which has been really lovely to hear your voices. Um, but one thing that I found from speaking to lots of you is that you may be working hard, but you're also not talking to your teachers um, when you don't quite understand something. So please do keep that communication open. We are here to help you. We are here to guide you through your work. And um, so keep working hard, stay safe, and hopefully I will see you all soon. I miss you all very, very much. And um, so hopefully I will speak to you all at some point.
this week or over the next two weeks.